Hey everyone, this is Ash. This is the last weekend. Let's check it out. Finally, this is the place. Anthony, you're a navigation genius. Says Rita, who can't even tell left from right. Calm down. Look how beautiful it is. Alice, wait for me. Alice doesn't care. Paul, hurry up. Paul doesn't care. Wait a second. My backpack is stuck. Hi. Welcome. I've been waiting for you. Our GPS doesn't show your hotel. We got lost. You are not the first guest to have that problem. You're here now. Come on in. By the way, my name is Sophia. I own this hotel. Looks like a house, Sophia. Here are the keys for your rooms. As you booked it, the boys get single rooms and the girls get double. Okay. We're gonna start with that one. Okay, choose Rita. I'm too lazy to have my things unpacked already. At least you're honest. No, I don't want to work yet. I thought you were here on vacation, not to work. How about the argument with Alice? I gotta find out what she's doing. Okay, let's go. Rita, I need a favor from you. I hope it's not about the money you owe me. You're boring. I'll give it back, I promise. That's not boring, that's money. Okay? What is it then? Listen, can you ask Paul to invite Anthony to my room? That sounds really complicated. Why don't you just invite him yourself? You don't understand. I want to seduce him. He enters the room while I'm changing, and it's like he accidentally sees me naked. Wow, you put a lot of thought into this. You're such a pervert. You just envy my devious seduction skills. You're not even on my level when it comes to manipulating men. What is going on here? I don't want to be a part of this. Manipulation. I bet you can't do the same with Paul. Let's make a bet. What? What is this game? Am I just seducing men? Oh, hey. Nice shirt. Have you looked around already? Not yet. Getting sober after seeing the view from the window. Wait, wait, wait. You're telling me you weren't sober on the drive over here? Weren't you the one driving? I, I don't remember. When you're done, come see me. I got a better view. Well, Rita. Way to be forward. Okay, I will. Oh. Can I look in this closet? What do you want to see there? I don't know. Maybe you have a nice jacket? I mean, if you have a nice jacket, I'd like to see it. Thank you. Uh, can I look in your mirror? No. Okay, bye. Oh wait, I was supposed to make you do something. Closed. Uh. The water is so cold here. Is it from the lake? Probably. Is this bathtub? Just in front of the door, as if it was meant for comfortable peeping. What is going on with you? What? What is? What is this? Is it? All right. If I put something here, the door won't close properly from inside. What? I think I brought some toothpicks with me. I should, those should do it. What, what's wrong, what, Rita, what are you doing? I have toothpicks somewhere. I need them. Great, I got toothpicks. I only have to put them inside the lock. Okay, Rita. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go talk to Paul real quick. I can't. All right. Ah, uh, Rita, what are you doing? 
Now we just wait until Paul finds out about it. Go tell Paul. Paul, I wanted to take a shower, but the door won't close. Can you check it out for me, please? Maybe you just need to push it harder. I tried. It won't work. Let's go check it out. Sure, Paul. What's with the door? You're right. It won't shut. Crap, can you watch the door while I'm in there? Why worry? Who's going to peep on you? That sounds... That sounds like a bad thing to say, Paul. Maybe nobody, but I will feel safer. Rita, you're paranoid. Actually, Alice told me that Anthony peeps on girls in the gym shower sometimes. You should have told me before. I'll watch the door. Thank you. I knew I could rely on you. Maybe I'll just stand in the corner for a while. No way. Stay right there. The door opens by itself. Now wait here for half an hour at least. Oh, he looks... Uh, oh, no. Oh, no. Paul. You, you did it, Paul. Thank you, Paul. Not at all. Of course it's not a problem for Paul. Uh, that's it? That That's it? Um... Okay. What, what are you doing? What are you doing, Alice? So, did you do it? Sure, it was perfect. And you? Me too, I did it. You must have left the laptop with a nude selfie open. Ha, I'm not that bad. I'm intrigued, tell me. He was peeping on me while I was in the shower. Cool, I totally admit your victory. Can we go to the lake? Sure. I've already chosen the perfect bikini. I'll go change. Wow. This is a great story. Let me go get changed. Um, closet. Now we can swim in the lake. <laughs> That's a good scene. How was that dinner? Yeah, but good, but not big enough. You never stop eating. I'd love to taste you. Just a lick. Anthony. No. I didn't know you had a gourmet taste. Ha 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 ha. I'm sitting here is so boring. I'll go for a walk. Please. I'll go for a walk. Sure. Uh, outside. Hey. Hi. Uh, if we were in this position, I would be sitting where you're sitting, just looking out at the rain, because that looks cool. Do you like rain? <laughs> I'm good at conversations. <laughs> Do you like this weather? I like rain. Why do you like it? It allows me to be sad. What? <laughs> I don't get it. Why do you want to be sad? Everybody tries to avoid sadness. I like the feeling of sadness. And I can only feel it when I look at the rain. What are you talking about, Sophia? I see you're an original. Oh, yeah. It doesn't get any more original than this. Have you lived here for a long time? Longer than I would prefer to. You don't like the place or the house? I don't like me. Have you tried to change? Changing isn't that easy. I, what, What is going on with you? I should go. Go. I'll stay here for a little while. Uh, good conversation. Goodbye. I'm going to go in the closet. Closed. Go upstairs. Maybe later. Closed. 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 
Not now. Well, that was a good, uh, good moment. Sitting here is so boring. Let's play something. What would you like to play? Who wants what? Maybe we should go to our rooms? I need to work. I agree. Alice, let's go. Oh, get lost. I want to stay here for a little while. Let's do the other option. Tired of this game. Oh no, I'm bored of it. Why? We know everything about each other already. Let's ask Sophia to join us. The owner? Why do we need her? I think she's cool. Yeah, let's call her. Paul, would you please invite her? Why me? That was your idea, so go. Okay, I will. Paul is going. Let's drink some more while he's away. To friendship. What do you think? Will she come? Yes. No. She doesn't want to play. The triumph of a loser. That sucks. No chance. Yeah, she's too stubborn. Maybe he said something wrong. He probably never spoke to her anyway. Shut up. Maybe you go. Calm down. Alice, stand up. We'll go together and talk her into it. Girl talk! Hey. Would you like to join us for dinner? No. What a pity. We would really like you to be there. I'm afraid I'll ruin your party. Please. I promise as soon as you get bored of us, we'll let you go. You're determined, young lady. I wonder how far you're going you're really prepared to go. Try me. Show me your breast. What? Why? That's my condition if you want me to join you. Sure, whatever. Alright. Fine, you can look if you want to. You got me. Let's go. Just let me give you some advice. Alice, please take off this flashy dress. It doesn't suit you at all. Alright. She's not wearing a dress. Sophia. She's wearing pants and a shirt. And you too, Rita. Do not take the boat. I'm not wearing a dress. I wasn't going to, but why? It might be dangerous. I'm going to change and come back. The ladies were kind enough to invite me. I hope you don't mind, gentlemen. Not at all. Have a seat. Wait, I don't get it. How does this game work? The player picks a card, reads a question, and tries to act out the answer without using any words. The other players are supposed to guess what he is trying to say. The one who gets it wins. Sounds interesting. Let's try. What supernatural being would you like to be? Wonder Woman? A fairy? Maybe a muse? I think it's a mermaid. No, it's not. I would like to be death. Ha! Huh. Well, let's all raise our glasses and may our dreams come true. Ah, what happened? No pulse. She's dead. Holy shit. What do we do now? We need to call the police. Yeah, call. There's no signal. There should be. Call the police if you don't believe me, smartass. Anthony is right. There is no signal. Maybe there is a landline. I think I saw a telephone somewhere. Exactly. Go find it, and we'll try to find a spot with a better signal. Yeah, great. Yeah, awesome. 
I've always dreamed of a weekend like this. Oh. Well, I'm gonna save there. Uh, anyway, this game's weird. So. Thanks for watching. Um, see you next time. Bye.